In case you don't know, this video is being they filmed the exact same day. So I just dropped the uh, top three YouTuber video, and y'all should go watch that. But anyway, we're finna get right into the video, bruh. Let's get lit. We gonna go with number one. Number one is Sponge Method, bruh. The reason why I say Sponge Method on number one is because obviously I started Sponge Method when I was doing semi-free form dress, right? I did Sponge Method, and it was cool. I'm gonna show you a picture of what that looked like when I was doing Sponge Method. I'm dropping that right now. And yeah, Sponge Method, it's, it's cool. I mean, when it gets longer, it's... Either way, the longer your dress get, bruh, I think the problem with Sponge Method is like, sometimes when you sponge your hair and like you start twisting in the front, but like they dangle in your face. And like, I think that's another reason why I low-key cut them. Cause I didn't want the dreads in my face, but I, sometimes I wonder if I kept my sponge ones. Mmm, they would be a high, cause I kept messing with them a lot, man. But yeah, bro, sponge method at number one, like that's OD, one of the most goaded methods to do your dreads. But on to the next number two, bro. We got two strand twist dread method, bro. Why do I say two strand twist method? Cause obviously I'm doing two strand twist method, bro. But you know, do you guys still see my pattern? My two strand pattern? Probably, bro. I don't know, bro. I really haven't been looking at my hair lately, but two strand twist method is it's cool. Like it does it it takes it low key takes kinda longer to dread up because I don't know, sometimes they unravel. It depends on your hair texture. It kinda depends on your hair texture. I'm not even gonna lie. Like if you have like three A, that's gonna take a mad long to lock up. If you have like I don't know, Kunta Kente hair, then your hair gonna be like lightweight like easier to lock up. But two strand twist method, by far one of my favorite methods to start my dreads on. But on to the next method. For three, we got cone coils. Cone coils. All right, so with cone coils, bro, cone coils is, eh, it's kind of a hit or miss in my opinion this is going off of my opinion bro like y'all could say nah some of y'all dreads probably watching this video you like oh i started mine with cone coils and my dress came out fine mine's low-key didn't you know what i'm saying like i mean i could have been more patient in in my eyes but i really wasn't messing with it, it was, it's the it's that after shine bro like you know how you like have cone coils and like y'all see that shine bro like oh tick the girls it's the shine for me it's not funny. All right, but cone coil method. Basically, they just if you go to a lactation, like they just wrap it around your head. Like they take the comb, they like do this weird magic wand looking effect, and like it it comes out springy and coily, and you just leave it alone and it just dreads up. It mats up together, all in one, just intertwines, intermingles, and blah 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 blah. blah. <laughs> and you start getting the button phase and all that stuff, etc., etc. And the rest is history. You got dreads now, but on to the next method, man. All right, so number four, towel rub. Towel rub dreads. It's kind of like sponge mud. So towel rub is kind of like sponge rub method, bro. Except you just gotta take a microfiber towel and you just rub it across your head like mad hard. But it's kind of it's just like dread. I said just like dress. It's just like sponge method, but it's just you're using a towel instead, bro. Like all the all the stuff that I told you about the sponge method dress, you basically gonna get the same results in towel method dress. But there's really not much to say for towel method dress. It's kind of like sponge method, but yeah, that's all I can tell y'all about towel rub method, bro. But on to the next free form, free form, bro. Now what free form hair, bro? What y'all really got the game twisted with, bro? Is free form hair is literally. You do absolutely nothing to it, like, bro, you don't care how it forms, it could just stick up, poke out, it could look like a turd, like a full turd, bro, like, you don't do nothing to it, you just let it do, do what it do, like, you can start free forms, like, with the sponge, and after you sponge it, you don't even touch it, like, you just wash it, you do whatever you please with your hair. Free form is, like, that's exactly what free form is, bro, like, a lot of Rosses do it, bro, but free form hair, bro, you just leave it alone. And you do absolutely nothing to it, bro. Okay, man. Okay. Well, that's gonna be the end of the video, y'all, bro. <laughs> Woo! Oh, bro. I hope y'all enjoyed the video, bro. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, bro. Name some ideas, bro. Q and A coming soon, bro. So DM me, bro. Like for real, cause I posted on my story, bro. Y'all didn't even send me no like, bro. DM me, bro. For real, cause I wanted to get this Q and A out the way, bro. Mugbang coming soon. Yes, mugbang coming soon. 
Will I do a never have I ever? Will I do a dirty truth or dare? I don't know yet, bruh. But make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, bruh, for real, bruh, because we finally hit 60 subs, bruh. Now we on the road to 100, bruh. 100 subs. That's the goal is to get to 100 subs, bruh. And y'all, 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 y'all doing y'all's thing, bruh. Like, y'all viewing it. And I appreciate it, bruh. But make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, bruh. More content coming soon, bruh. Morgan got game. The channel finna, the channel finna go crazy, bro. I'm telling y'all, bro. But I love y'all. Y'all have a good one.